carpet. I also got a can of paint uh, from Habitat. This carpet, it's great stuff. I've got it in the back of the uh, the Volvo and it's in I line my toolbox drawers with it too. It, uh, it's a interior carpet for cars. This stuff isn't molded. You can heat mold this stuff and uh, and make it any shape that you want if you press it. So, um, anyways, this is just gonna cover the bunks. I also have this same carpet around my dock out at the yacht club. It's raining. It might squash my plans on getting the bunks done today. Well, I've had to go out and uh, I've got to do some banking and I got go to the grocery store for tomorrow. I forgot, or actually I didn't know, that there's a parent-teacher meeting tomorrow that I've got to go to. Heidi's... Oh, Heidi's busy doing a yoga thing that she's planned weeks ago. So I've got to go to it. I won't have wheels, so we've invited Mom over for supper. I'm going to borrow her car and she's going to look after Jasmine. Well, I go to the parent-teacher evening thing. Earlier on, I drew uh, my bunk system, how it's going to be set up with the board and the other blocks that will attach where the, uh, the rollers used to be. So I'll show that little drawing next. So here's my bunk idea, and uh, next time you see me I'll be in the garage painting those blocks that uh, I got, uh, or that I made yesterday. I might, no I won't, I'm thinking about painting the bunks, but there's no sense. They're pressure treated. They should be fine. The bunk's actually going to be curved. So I'm going to attach the uh, the blocks first, then I'll compress the uh, the board down, and then I'll wrap it with the uh, the carpet. It's uh, going to be held on by the roller holders, and these blocks will be drilled through twice, and. Uh, then my bunk itself will be set on top of that. This is almost the perfect size for my bunks. This is my carpet. So this is just a little bit smaller than the uh, than the, the bunks, but the bunk will cover the uh, metal bits that uh, it's gonna that will be holding this. So there'll be two holes. Each one will have to be drilled individually because these aren't set up in any special way. Well, I've got to set up my fancy painting uh, area, which will be over here. And I'll be using <laughs> this nice yard waste bag. I'll be using I picked up today from Habitat and it's a melamine paint it's black uh, 
It's a CIL. It was three dollars and seventy-five cents. Great deal. Twice the price. This trailer's gonna need another full paint job. And it's not gonna happen this year. When I do that, I'll use uh, the rust paint. That's a dark blue. Hmm. Well, we'll see what happens. Let's see what we end up with. I don't want to paint that side. I want to paint the ugly side. The ugly sides are going on the bottom. Stuff looks really black on the can. So, well, it'll be what it'll be. Got one down. If you can probably tell, I'm not doing the best job on these because they're just going to hold up a boat. Well, I'm done. I've got everything painted. Now it's just a matter of cleaning the brush, cleaning me. Don't know if this is water soluble. Oh, looks like it is. Well, there we go. They're all painted. Now, tomorrow I will be able to put, install them on the trailer and uh, then I'll be able to attach my boards. What I'll do is when I figure out how long my boards are going to be, I'll bring them in here and I'll cut the carpet it's back here to fit the boards perfectly. So it'll go around and actually overlap a bit. So I'll uh, cut those, get those put on. I'll be using stainless steel screws to hold them on, uh, screw them to the blocks and as well as glue. That's why I didn't paint that one side of the, that'll be the top side. This is the bottom of the mall. So it'll be screwed and glued on, and then I'll put the, the carpet on over top of that. And I've got some, uh, have I got galvanized staples. I called the hardware store asking for stainless staples, and they said, oh yeah, we've got a couple of different sizes. They galvanized, but it'll work. It's not going to last forever, so. And, uh, but those will work better than the the regular steel ones. So that's it for me. Thanks for watching. Click the clicky things and tell your mom.